we'd like to invite you to take a moment to pause, to stop doing and explore being with one of Vincent van Gogh's artworks. So find a peaceful place, sit comfortably, and let's begin. Let's take a moment to just be with Vincent's painting, Self-Portrait with Felt Hat, a painting that invites us to make contact with Vincent and to intentionally look, to explore, to really observe. You could take a moment to close your eyes if that feels okay for you. We'll look closer at the painting in a moment. For now, notice the shape of your body. Invite your shoulders to release and allow your hands to rest comfortably, perhaps in your lap or next to the body. Become aware of the breath, following the in and the out breath from moment to moment. There's no need to change anything. Just noticing. And noticing if you can bring your attention to your face. Gently bringing awareness to your jaw, your mouth, the corners of your mouth, your nose and your nostrils. And then slowly bringing all your attention to your eyes, the muscles of the eyes, the eyelids, eyelashes, your eyebrows, and the space between the eyebrows. Moving attention along the forehead, to both ears, and widening the attention to include the whole head all the way to the crown. And then being aware of the sense of sight and gently opening your eyes, bringing your attention to the colors the brush strokes to light and dark. Invite your eyes to explore the self-portrait of Vincent and see if you can let go of what you think you know about him and in letting go to connect to Vincent with fresh eyes. Exploring with open awareness his face, his expression. Allow your eyes to meet his. Make eye contact. Noticing your initial reactions. Maybe there's physical reactions as you make contact. A smile around your mouth, a sensation in the region of your heart, or maybe you notice something else in your body. And noticing emotional reactions. Does his presence have an impact on your emotions, your mood, or your thoughts? And you can welcome any and all reactions. There's no right or wrong reaction to have. Even if you don't notice anything, that's perfectly fine. You're practicing noticing what reactions may or may not arise as you make contact. Isn't it amazing that in this moment we're connecting with the face of Vincent? A self-portrait painted over 130 years ago. 
Vincent wanted to practice painting portraits. And models were expensive, so he often painted himself. And in each picture, we see a different version of Vincent. Recognizable, but never completely the same. He explored different aspects of himself, using different colors, different techniques, testing things out, creating, playing, daring to look critically and to be honest. And in this way of working, there's not really so much right and wrong, just exploration. At times, Vincent revealed his vulnerability as he confronted himself in the mirror. Other times, there's an inquisitive look as he became the object being studied. And sometimes he showed himself as the painter he was. Does this ever happen to you? That you show different aspects of yourself to the world around you? How is it for you to notice this? Having different faces isn't a bad thing. At the same time, we live in a time where everything can be created. We stage perfect photos with filters and adjustments, hiding our flaws, our uncertainties, our failures, and then treating these same illusions of others as truth. Unrealistic ideals can lead us to judgment, to self-doubt. What if instead we curiously get to know the incomplete, the imperfect nature of life, sharing our cracks, our shortcomings, our humanness with each other, knowing that we all have our challenges. And take a moment to close your eyes again. Bring your attention to the movement of your breath. your whole body, the expression on your face, present and complete, just as you are, with everything that comes along with that. And then, gently opening your eyes. Thank you for joining. We're glad you could be here with Vincent.